Hi Leo, welcome to your reading. If you are new here and don't want to miss the daily tarot readings, you can subscribe now by clicking the red button below this video. This is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. At the end of this video, if you are interested, I will also record an extended to know more specific details on their feelings and intentions for you at this moment. Now let's start with your reading. First, let's shuffle the deck four times. Let's see what is the overall energy. Queen of Swords. Thinking logically, being more mature and not thinking with the heart but with the mind. Wanting to look at the picture based on facts and not emotions. Now let's see more details. Let's see what do we have here. First I will see what happened in the past and why it all happened. Then at the end of this reading their possible <coughs> sorry their possible actions towards you if any so there was lots of he hesitation there someone didn't uh, didn't decide what they wanted to do to move on or stay and uh, there was not love as well the love was not deep and powerful with the queen of cups here that is at the position of the challenge, it tells me that they didn't express much feelings or they didn't have any feelings or deep feelings for the connection. At the current situation, I think you want to reach out to them, you want to message them, you want to hear, you want to hear from them because you love them. Your love is pure. King of Cups. Now let's see what is affecting you in your subconscious. The fact that they were harsh and they may still be harsh, the fact that uh, they are distant emotionally, they may have been mean, arrogant before, cold and, and, cold and detached. That's uh, what is affecting you in your subconscious. How you view the situation? There's lots of overthinking. You feel confused. You feel stressed out when you think about that situation. Let's see about what you want to avoid. Here we have two cards of similar um, energy. And what is your fear? Your fear is that they were not honest and that they are avoiding you. Also, your, what you want to avoid is being in a connection that is conflictual and when they are not honest. When they, are, when they are not straightforward. You want them to be straightforward and honest to you. Let's see what is happening with them. What is their energy? Knight of Wands in the reverse. This person is very inconsistent in love. Not very stable. The connection may have been on and off as well. Okay, so we have the tower. And the Seven of Swords. This person is at crossroads now. They need to make a decision. What happened was unexpected to them. They didn't expect it to, hap to happen that fast and destroy their relationship. And here they are trying to avoid you. That's that fear that you have here. They are trying to avoid you and this person may have cheated on you as well or they were not honest. So take what resonates. At the bottom we have the King of Pentacles. I see being uh, them being focused on their work as well. Now let's see what is uh, what are their actions towards you, if any. Ten of Cups. They want to marry you. They want to marry you. So let's see. Nine of Pentacles. Seven of Pentacles. And the Sun. 
at the bottom is two of cups. So it is very clear. This person wants to be with you. Okay, so what I'm getting here is that this person really was inconsistent in the connection before. And they may still be if it is not uh, talked and uh, said clearly that you don't like that behavior if you don't like it. And I think you don't like it because it is it is not healthy to be in a connection when one partner is on and off and changes their mind constantly and makes the other partner confused. Now, uh, they would like a second chance with the, with the karma card here or the judgment. They would, they would like a second chance. They were not honest before and they didn't expect it to happen like that. But here they are working on their, on their business or their work being independent, wanting to be more financially independent, but still they are waiting for you because they imagine now that they are not as happy as they were uh, in the connection with you. So they are waiting to see some progress there and their dream is to, to marry you, to be long term with you because you make them happy. So I sense they didn't express much feelings before or they were a bit cold and detached, even harsh sometimes, maybe arrogant. This person confused you a lot, but you love them. Now, I will continue this reading for more details in the extended where I want to see. How does your person feel now? How do they view you now? What are their intentions and also the mutual energies and the energies around each one of you. If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below. See you the next reading and bye for now.